decided that I'm going to get myself an unconventional pet. <laughs> the reason being is because I've had cats, I've had dogs, I've had lizards, iguanas. Um, this pet would be more useful to me. <laughs> I'm tired of going to the store and pushing a cart or a carriage. <laughs> yes, folks, I'm going to get me a kangaroo. <laughs> yep, it's going to have one of these vests that says, Therapeutical pet, do not touch or pet. <laughs> it comes with a nice pouch. <laughs> and they're known to be good boxers. <laughs> Like that, when I go to Walmart, they're not going to try to force me to wear a mask. I'll sick my kangaroo after them. Yep. So, when I go shopping, no more carriage. All my stuff goes in the pouch. So, since we're in the subject of kangaroos, I have a joke for you. Why is it that, kangaroo, that mother kangaroos are not happy when it rains? Because her kids got to play inside. Besides all the wonderful things that a kangaroo can do, box, dance, go shopping, they also like hip-hop. Now, my favorite music isn't hip-hop, but if my kangaroo wants to listen to hip-hop, he can listen to hip hop. <laughs> hip hop uh, kangaroos do not like to be called names. But I had a private conversation with my kangaroo. <laughs> if he gets lazy on me, my name for him is Pouch Potato. <laughs> So a kangaroo, a snake, and a spider, and a turtle walked into a bar. A perfectly normal day in Australia. Um, I went out one night with my kangaroo, and I found out how cheap he was. <laughs> He didn't buy me one single drink. Talk about short arms and deep pockets. I'm wondering, if I marry a kangaroo, I can save a lot of money. a kangaroo, I would have a house. I just live in the pouch. I don't need a car because she can take me to work in a pouch. Um, you, we would get along just
just fine. Me and the kangaroo. As long as we're on good terms, she won't file for divorce. I don't want to get kicked out of the pouch.